Hi there, band parents and band students. I am just going to uh, create this little video for you as kind of an announcement thing and just to give you a heads up of what we did today in band. Parents, there's quite a few things going on. I'll try to make this as quick as possible. Uh, one thing you may not know, if you would like to speed this up, if you're really busy, you can click on the gear at the bottom of the YouTube video and you can speed me up and listen to this and fast forward. That should be fun. So UAEL is the first thing we talked about today. It stands for Uni Unity, Artistry, Excellence, and Legacy. And those are the things that we're um, trying to pursue as our overarching goals this year. Um, obviously, unity is, is something we all need, and uh, we provide that in band. We do try to do things the same uh, and try to figure out what's best for each instrument and uh, do that. Artistry, obviously, we're trying to to create something beautiful with many different feelings that we can portray for the audience and entertain them. Excellence, well, that's just obvious. We need to try hard in the face of mistakes, in the face of challenges, and uh, all the everything that we do at home for practice time and how we treat each other and everything. Uh, we want to be as uh, awesome as we can be and leave behind a good legacy, a reputation of quality. So that's the first slide there. Another slide we went through today talks about our daily routine. If you want to check this out, uh, right now in the beginning of the year, we'll be spending more time on fundamentals and less time on the band's concerts, and that'll gradually switch over to, um, you know, a couple weeks from now, we'll be focusing more on the band tunes. But for now, we need to figure out how it is we're going to play this game. So we're not going to um, send somebody out to play quarterback without a helmet and without plays and without a ball. So we need to kind of get everything situated. And that's the fundamentals uh, right here in the middle. So once we get working on our fundamentals, uh, all these things having to do with, with how we play, then we'll move on towards uh, working on our band music for the concert. These are some of the things that we do uh, broken down by days. Most, of, most Mondays we'll be focusing on grades turning in assignments, performance assessments, checking in on our grades, and stuff like that. Tone quality is what we'll be thinking about every Tuesday. Uh, rhythms on Wednesdays, music theory on Thursdays, and then on Fridays we'll do some alternative rehearsal techniques, which you can see here. Anything from silent rehearsals, rehearsal in the round, just mixing things up, having a guest conductor, or standing up, or uh, doing some various things that are a little different. Here's what we focused on today in class. Who are we? So we obviously went through our, our roster just to make sure we know who plays what and who's where. One of the things that uh, that includes is finding out which cubby we have assigned to us. So students have a spot um, to put their instrument in the band area, and that is listed in Schoology if kids are not aware of where that is. We did have a glitch this morning. There was nothing on our Schoology course when we showed up. And we've since fixed that. So check out which cubby you have so that on Thursday when you walk through here off the bus in the morning, you can find the right cubby quickly. And then we talked about why music. There's a short, easy assignment that we've already finished. You just have to type in your answers. Uh, we, we thought about it. We paired up. We shared with each other what we think about music. Why is it important? Um, why do we practice so hard? What do we gain from it? And why does it exist everywhere in the world? So uh, these are the homework as assignments, basic stuff. Bring your instrument on Thursday. Um, buy the Essential Elements Book 2. We will start using that next week. And then finish the Schoology discussion for why music. Here's a breakdown of how we did everything. Um, and here are the questions that are on, on that assignment. So you can check that out if you'd like to, but no big deal. Uh, I wanted to make a few announcements here. Prairie Colors Marching Band Festival is on Saturday, and you can check out the schedule. Um, you can visit the Eden Prairie High School band page, and that'll connect you. Um, and they're having their competition hosted at Eden Prairie High School on Saturday. Go check it out. Uh, here's the book that we are going to be using this year. It's book two of the Essential Elements for Band series, and I want you to get that. It comes with a lot. It comes with a lot of online features that we'll be using this year. A lot of play-alongs and assessment tools and, and great things for your student. We're going to use it every day. Um, percussionists, you can bring your stick bag and your mallet bag. It should look just like this. And um, it says here, start selling those bell sets. I'll talk some more about that in another video coming up later. If you play baritone, French horn, tuba, and I suppose bassoon, bass clarinet, uh, tenor sax, barry sax, any instrument that um, you're not going to have 
bringing back and forth. We're going to have it at school for you. You just need to bring your mouthpiece, uh, some valve oil or any cleaning supplies you need, and a rag. And you can keep that in a little pouch. Maybe it's better to clip it into your binder, uh, whatever you feel works best. But you're going to need those every time we have a rehearsal. This is a cubby. Keep your instrument in there during the day. Do not leave your instrument above your locker or in the hall or in a classroom. That's no good. Um, if you can't practice some night, you can leave it there overnight. Uh, but you don't want to leave it here too many times or you're not going to get a chance to practice. There is a band information survey. I did not mention this to the students today because I knew that I would be sending this video home. The band information survey has a link that I'll provide in the email. So if you click on that email or link, it'll take you to the survey that you can fill out and it should be self-explanatory. We're going to collect some information about your instrument and about uh, some of your interests. We have a daily quote. The only real mistake is the one from which we learn nothing. Sometimes we have a joke of the day. And then today I went through some photos uh, just to get to know me a little bit. Basically what my, my main goal here is to connect with students uh, in some way. So I went through and asked if there's something here that they found that they could connect with me on in a conversation in the future. So I explained all of these things, some of my interests from fly fishing to cars to campfires to where we got married in Glacier National Park uh, to hiking and camping, some of my favorite bands and such like that. So you can check out these photos as well. I like movies. I like to run. This is my Jeep. This is my wife and I. This is Oscar. He's now almost 16 months old. We just went on a trip for two weeks. There he is flying on the airplane. We went out to Olympic National Park. We went to Mount Rainier and Mount St. Helens. We went to Shy Shy Beach, Cape Flattery. Some great pictures turned out. Anyway, I, and I, I would like to share that these photos with you parents as well so you can kind of get to know me and try to make a connection on some level there's crater lake and we're back to the original spot let me see if i can transition here quickly over to the the next part which is the student's schoology course as you can see here if you ever want to help your student here's how you locate your band cubby there's two links there here's the order form for the book and here's the handbook all of this stuff is referenced in this student information survey, which I will have linked in the email. So uh, there's lots of good stuff here. Our YouTube channel has lots of these videos that I've created, and as well as other resources. CMS Music website, this is all right there on their Schoology page. Well, so that's it. I uh, hope I didn't take too much of your time, and uh, I will see you uh, soon at Curriculum Night. Those are coming up. Check your calendars and uh, and at concerts. So thanks in advance for your support, uh, and hopefully everything that you need can be found in this survey that you're about to take. I will let you know right now that this you the the tube and band book order form, as well as the band handbook link, uh, are are both added in to this survey. So you'll find everything you need. Thanks a lot. Have a good one. We'll see you soon.